FinTech Sandbox is a nonprofit formed to aggregate financial data and make it available for FinTech entrepreneurs and startups to build applications and services. The FinTech Sandbox was developed based on a clear and pressing need from the startup community. One of the most difficult things that we found was actually access to data. And so the FinTech Sandbox came out of that problem statement to actually make it a smoother transition um, for the startups, but also make it cost effective. The value of the FinTech Sandbox is to allow us to explore and really play with the data before we have to pay for it. We don't ask for equity or cash from startups in exchange for the data. But what the data partners and ourselves want is to contribute to the user forum in a sense and the snippets of code that help create shortcuts to accessing the data. For a young company, free access for data is incredibly important. We have a limited budget. We have limited resources. So by having this, we're able to access worlds that we couldn't even play in otherwise. With the FinTech Sandbox data partners that we've been able to use, we've gotten access to that data. So we've been able to accelerate our development immeasurably because of that. Boston and New York are very strong centers of innovation when it comes to fintech. You have the people that need the product and you have the people that can build the product. Having those two things right there and then someone like the fintech sandbox to make the connection, you, you literally can't have a better scenario. You know, we have been able to re-energize people here and with the number of uh, events we had, three demo days, uh, over 200 plus applicants. We have 50 plus uh, companies who have participated. I think just the people coming together and talking about it, there's just a lot of excitement. FinTech Sandbox demo days differ in terms of other demo days in that we are not pitching for money. We are really demonstrating the possibilities of our product. We have found a number of potential customers, we have found potential partners, and a lot of ideas for where to take our product. In total, the benefit of the Sandbox has been early on to help us start, and of course access to data to put up a version that is usable and adds value. Subsequently, it's really the benefit of the community, both from a business development standpoint, meeting investors. Increasingly, as I speak to younger people, they're really interested in looking at how can this technology help you know, in areas of financial inclusion or in terms of urban poverty. So I think we're seeing technologies that now starting to solve real problems that humanity faces. We're gonna see some very interesting companies come out of that space. We have an opportunity to help these big companies get ready for the disruption that is coming. There's companies like the Sandbox that are helping facilitate these companies evolve with this changing technology. So I'm most excited about financial technology's ability to help the capital markets move us forward globally.